Hey, what's up everybody? Chris Young from Gander RV and Outdoors inside the 2020 Heartland Mallard M185. Now, if you've been looking for a lightweight travel trailer that's gonna sleep more than four people and you just want something to go set up, maybe it's a hunting trip, girls getaway trip, this is the camper you have been looking for. And I'm gonna start right back here at the bunks. So, 200 pound max capacity bunks, both up top and down below. You got these nice plush three inch fuzzy teddy bear mattresses on top, big windows. And if you look down there, my friend who bought one of these said, well, that's the doggy door. That's the doggy escape door, but it's actually a really good exit. And it also gives you access to the storage underneath this bunk, which I will show you later on. Got your access panel right here for your circuits. We move up to the kitchen. And even though this is a small trailer, 18 footer, they did not skimp on the kitchen. You still have a three burner stove with the push buttons, got the grill top, storage underneath with these shaker style cabinets, brush nickel fixtures. So lots of storage space, lots of prep space actually for a small camper. Microwave there, got your double deep, deep well sinks right here. And these are also cutting boards. So if you need to use those, they're right there. Brush nickel high rise faucet with the extender there. And right up here, I don't know if you can see that well, but there's your cable plug and your power. So if you wanted to mount a TV, you could just mount it here. Come over to the dinette, got the booth dinette with the large window on the side. This does extend out into a bed, but what a great space. If you want to feed four people, you want to, you know, play cards, do the games, the board games and whatnot. And this table actually comes out. So if you want to take it outside and use it outside for games and entertaining, you absolutely could. But once again, converts into a bed, got the frosted glass on the strut supported doors up here. So more storage there, got the nice large roof mounted AC with quick cool that comes in handy in the heat. Queen size bed up front with the bright LED lights and a storage shelf up top. Not to mention the little cubby over here on the bottom right hand side where you have a space underneath the table. So if you want to put books, you know, whatever in there, plus you have the plugs to plug in lights, charge your phone, etc. Ward storage right here. So if you want to hang your coats, your sweaters, running gear, Got your AM FM control panel right over here. And you say, okay, well, that's pretty cool, Chris, but what about the bathroom? That's right past the uh, fridge right here. I mean, look at the space in there. Small camper. Yes, you could get the beverages that you want. And this runs on both electric and gas. But we come back here to the bathroom. Nice medicine cabinet. Plenty of leg room here. Plenty of leg room. Got the toilet with the foot flush. Come over here to the shower. Not that cramped. I mean, for a small camper, it's really not that bad. I'm six foot two and I'd be fine in here. Yeah, you got to hunker over a little bit, but for the size, for the weight, for the price, you really can't beat this. But look at the room I got left to right. I mean, this is, this is still pretty nice. Mirrored medicine cabinet right there. I really like these brushed nickel fixtures. They just make it seem a little bit more homey. That makes sense. Okay. So we've seen the inside of this M185. Now let's take a look at the outside. Okay. So here we are on the outside of the 2020 Heartland Mallard M185. Talk about a small camper that can sleep up to six people. This is perfect for you. If you've been looking for something lightweight with the space, you want to come check this one out. Wanted to show you what the two 20 pound propane tanks look like without the cover. We have had some people ask about that. Yes, there are mounts that kind of keep them secure, but we just wanted to show you that so you kind of see what it looks like. Fiberglass exterior with the two inch thick insulation to help with those elements. Got the diamond plated rock guard. We come around here to the pass through storage. For a small camper, this one keeps some really good storage. Want to put your hunting rifles in there, your fishing gear, get really good space there. Plus it's lit and finished off, which just gives it a really nice touch. So small things I like that Heartland does. Large awning, which goes almost the entire length of the camper. Got the tinted black rubber sealed windows all the way around this camper. The exterior speakers, which are really loud. So with the cover, the awning, the speakers, plus the plugs here, if you want to do, you know, charge your phones, plug in some entertainment, this is a great space to do that outside entertaining. Set the grill up and just have fun with it. Get your scissor jacks on the front and the rear of this camper. 
And if you take a look at the wheels, that is a 15 inch aluminum wheel on this single axle travel trailer. Come around here, you got your four x four sewer hose storage full-size spare tire and these are set up for backup cameras so if you want to get that going just talk to one of our specialists they'll be glad to help you now i had mentioned this when we were inside great doggy door great way to get in and out of the camper but strut supported storage and yes there's even a little lock space right up there to keep this up for you but look at the storage this gives you so if you don't have a lot of people to sleep and you want a smaller camper that has a lot of storage, look at that. Beach chairs, beach towels, hunting gear, fishing gear. You got all the space you need right there. Come back on this side. We have our exterior shower, city water connection, flush, as well as the fresh water connection there. Scissor jacks again. But if you've been thinking about upgrading that camping experience, you're done with the tents. You want to get into something that maybe is a little bit less than 4,500 pounds, always check the side panel to see what your truck can tow. If your truck can tow that, this is going to be a great camper for you. But leave us some comments down beneath, down below. Let us know what you think. Where would you like to take this camper? What would you do with it? What do you want to see? We here at Gander RV and Outdoors are about going to the extreme, and that means getting you extremely close to those dreams of perfect camping. I'm Chris Young for Gander RV and Outdoors. Thank you so much for spending time with us today. I look forward to hearing about your adventures when we catch up soon.